stuff is. Genera, Carrix, more of this stuff. These like fancy Grecian, it's Greek or Roman? I don't know. It's like walking into a temple of some kind. All right, Shore Acre Gardens Memorial Fountain in memory of lots and lots of people. Over a hundred people listed there. It's a little bamboo. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, no, it's a little no, gift no, no, center. It's cute. Hi there! You're watching the Gardens and Graveyard Channel. My name is Charisma, and Spencer and I are at Shore Acres. Acres. <laughs> you got it. You got it. In the Sunset Bay area outside of Coos Bay, Oregon. And it's just this beautiful botanical garden and rose garden. We're just going to walk around and check it out. We're making, making quite the substantial back deck there. Uh -huh. Look at these formal gardens, though. Gorgeous. What do you need? I would be showing all of that. Wow, look at that. Wow. <laughs> Look at that, wow, look at that, wow. There you look, look at that, wow. There's a rose garden in that circle. And there's a rose garden in that circle. This is why people love the formal. Is that a hitter, is that a hitter? That is cotton lavender, cotton lavender. or uh, Santanilia. We have a little patch of that. Mm. So that's uh, Hebe or Heather. Yeah, 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 that's, that's, that's Heather. Heather right behind it. That's huge. Yeah, huge right here, yeah. The boxwoods. Yeah, there's a little rose garden right there in the mm -hmm. corner. Roses are pretty much petered out. I don't know. There's roses all the way around the yeah, outside baby. edge, too. Mm -hmm. uh, that's very pretty. Oh, cool. yeah. and you can see the roses all the way around oh, yeah. that edge. Mm -hmm. Really beautiful.
guessing that we're getting into the ro or the Japanese garden. Yeah, it's Cryptomeria. Uh, that's Hebe. Yeah. I see a red Look at how pretty that is. like little pockets of planters here and there mm -hmm. as needed. Nick and Nick. Now we have the ability to make our own pot. Hydrangea macrophylla pia. Little cute. <laughs> now that we have uh, the ability to make our Cornus Cusa yeah. or Cornus Kipitata. It's the strawberry tree. It has the it's turned red. Oh, here's one. There you go. Fun? It's a dogwood. Uh huh. It's an evergreen Himalayan dogwood. That's cool. Hold on. I know, we need I one. one. I want that one. So they've just mirrored the other side. We were on the, okay. over on the other side okay. of this walkway. And now it's basically the same thing. And that's what they do in formal gardens. Yeah. <laughs> the old square bricks. And the aggregated sidewalk. I almost missed it if I hadn't turned around. Rose garden and greenhouse this direction. Yeah. Of course, I have a map, but it's in my pocket. Doesn't do much work there. <laughs> Beautiful hedge of hydrangeas with the evergreen backdrop. Working on a gazebo back there. Some rhododendrons everywhere. 
And this gorgeous thing. Get that. in here. I like these bricks. Oh, look at that. Fuchsia hanging baskets. Zigzag. All American Rose Selections Display Gardens. Cool. Okay. Um, oh, look at the monkey puzzle tree. <laughs> hey, yeah. Fun. <laughs> the rhododendron grove in there. Hydrangeas. That big leaf roadie right there. Okay, here's an herb garden. Like it? Oh, bunny. Hi, bunny. Hi, sweet bunny. Are you eating the herbs, Peter Rabbit? <laughs> We're not going to get you. You can do your thing. It's frozen. I want to see the herb garden, bunny. 
See, there's a. Uh... There he goes. Um, rosemary, oregano, lamb's ear, native plant garden. It's gone to sleep for the winter, I think. All right, moving into the rose garden. Okay, beautiful formal rose garden, row after row of roses. Oh, lots of bunnies. <laughs> bunny, bunny. <laughs> Cute. We found the bunny den. Well, there's not a whole lot to see of the roses, so we don't need to disturb the bunnies. Just wanted to see. We'll have to come back in June or something and mm -hmm. see this garden. <laughs> this is one of those gardens that you want to visit <clears throat> three, four, or five times a year right. so that you could see all of the different ways that um, it shines. Uh, at least four seasons and they do a huge christmas display every yeah. year which i've been hearing noise about and haven't been to so hopefully we'll get to it um one of these years anyways you have to make reservations and you only get like i think it's like a 20 minute slot or something so you have to like be here wait in line in your car for a couple of hours walk around for 20 minutes and then yeah. go yeah. So it's not, it's not like a uh, relaxing adventure, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, probably worth it. Probably worth it. Definitely worth coming back to in the springtime to see all the rhododendrons in bloom and um, midsummer to see all the roses in bloom. So you might see a few more videos like, like this with different interest. That's going to do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed wandering around Shore Acres with us. And we hope that you're celebrating your life. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye.